Rachid Sharma had saved some money for his daughter's education, but it turned out to be a bit less. He needs an additional 2 lakh rupees. Now, he's in a dilemma whether to borrow or withdraw money from his public provident fund account, which is his PPF account. Now, withdrawing from PPF, that means premature withdrawal, as PPF matures in 15 years. However, under certain circumstances, you can withdraw money before completing 15 years of investment. Before explaining when you can withdraw money, you must understand how a PPF works. So, there is a 15-year lock-in in the PPF account. You can invest up to 1.5 lakh rupees per year in it. You can take advantage of the tax exemption under Section 80C on this amount. The entire amount received at the time of maturity is tax-free. Currently, the scheme pays an annual interest of 7.1%. The government reviews the interest of small savings schemes on a quarterly basis. Now comes the real question, when can you withdraw the money? If you have saved a good amount in PPF and need money urgently and there is no other way other than a personal loan, then you can withdraw money from PPF. For this, you will have to state a valid reason. You can withdraw the money from this PPF account for children's education, your treatment or of any other family member. This facility will be available after 6 years, that is from the 7th year of the investment onwards. But you cannot withdraw the entire amount. You can only withdraw 50% of the remaining balance at the end of the 4 years prior to the withdrawal year. Or you can withdraw 50% of the total de money deposited in the account at the time of withdrawal. You can only withdraw the amount which is lower in either of these two cases. For example, if Rachid opened a PPF account in the financial year 2016-17, he can withdraw the money from his PPF for his child's education only after 2022-23. He can withdraw either 50% of the balance at the end of the financial year 2018-19 or 50% of the total fund deposited as of March 31, 2023, whichever is lesser. So, it's good news for Rachid that he will be able to withdraw money from his PPF account before maturity for his daughter's education. His account will remain active even after making the withdrawal. But he has to keep in mind that he can only withdraw once a year. This amount will be tax-free and no penalty will be imposed on it. Now, let's understand if you can close your PPF account before the tenure of 15 years. In some cases, you can close your PPF account after 5 years. If the account holder himself or of his spouse or his child is suffering from a life-threatening disease, then for treatment, you can withdraw the entire amount and close your PPF account prematurely. Similarly, if the account holder or his children need money for higher education, then he or she can close the account. If the account holder has settled abroad, that is, he has become an NRI, then this account can be closed prematurely. 1% interest will be deducted when closing an account prematurely. If the account holder dies before maturity of the PPF account, then his nominee can withdraw the money. In such a case, even the condition of completing 5 years of the account is also eliminated. After the death of the account holder, his PPF account will be closed. The money is given to the nominee or the legal heir. Such accounts cannot be continued.